you. Yes. We recognize we live and we move and we have our being just because of you. Lord, we are nothing without you. We can do nothing without you. For you my shot. Lord, we you are our all in all. And we're ever so grateful. Not for self gratification, uh -huh. not for our own purpose, uh -huh. but we've come to see you. Yes. That your glory and your yes. and your wonder yes. to be revealed. Many of us come with many different needs, yes. but you're the supplier yes. of all our needs. Yes. And Lord, let your word fall upon good ground. Yes. That these your people. May be edified. Yes. That you, dear God, may be glorified. Yes. And most of all, the evil one terrified. Yes. So we clap our hands. Yes. We open our mouths. Yes. And pray, Lord. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes. And we give our shine. Yes. And we give you glory. Yes. And we give you glory. Yes. Come on. And we give you glory. I called her, I thought we were going to have to sit 
respiratory squad over there. But God has blessed them. We thank God for it. Yeah, and uh, I go ahead. And, um, and seeing the multitude. And seeing the multitude. He went up on a mountain. Uh -huh. And when he was seated, his disciples came to him. Uh -huh. Then he opened his mouth and uh -huh. taught them, saying. What did he say? Blessed are the poor in spirit, uh -huh. for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Yes. Blessed are those who mourn, for they shall be comforted. Uh -huh. Blessed are the meek, yes. for they shall inherit the earth. Yes. Blessed are those who hunger and thirst for righteousness, for they yes. shall be filled. Yes. Blessed are the merciful, mm -hmm. for they shall obtain mercy. Yes. Blessed are the pure in heart, mm -hmm. for they shall see God. Yes. Blessed are the peacemakers, yes. for they shall be called sons of God. Yes. Blessed are those who are persecuted for righteousness' sake, for theirs is the kingdom. Uh, before you go on, just look at somebody and point to them and say, Bless. Bless. Come on, point to the other side and say, Bless. 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 Read the book. Blessed, blessed are you when they reveal, revile and persecute you uh -huh. and say all kinds of evil against you falsely for my sake. Yes. Rejoice. Rejoice. And be exceedingly glad. Yes. For great is your reward in heaven. Mm -hmm. For so they persecuted the prophets yes. who were before you. Yes. You are the salt of the earth. Really? But if the salt loses its flavor, how shall it be seasoned? Uh -huh. It is then good for nothing <clears throat> but yes. to be thrown out and trampled underfoot by men. I hate you well, you I'm are the light this. of the world. Yes. A city that is set on a hill cannot mm -hmm. be hidden, yes. nor do they light a lamp and put it under a basket, but on a lampstand. And it is, and it gives light to all who are in the house. Read, Let your light so shine before men that they may see your good works and glorify your Father in heaven. Amen. Amen. The word of the Lord is Amen. 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 Just before you be seated, verse sixteen is where our text will be coming from. Amen. Let your light yes. so yes. shine before yes. men that they may see your good works uh -huh. and glorify your Father. Mm. Which is in heaven. Yes. Yes. Our topic today is how bright mm. is your light? All right. Turn to somebody and ask them, how bright, how bright is your light? Is your light? All right, here we are. Let me see the presence of the Lord. Here we are. Jesus is teaching. And it was in the three year span that he taught his father's will and the word of the Lord. Yes. Here is what we call the Beatitudes, yes. uh, where Jesus speaks of the blessings yes. that should be the characteristics uh -huh. of a believer. Uh -huh. How do you know that when Christ comes into your life, there must be a difference yes. than what it used to be? Yes. I don't hear nobody here. Yes. I said, when Christ comes yes. in your life, there has to be a change. Yes. When I was coming up as a young boy, a brother pastor, they used to have the revivals. They used to say, I looked at my hands, and my hands looked new. I looked at my feet, and my feet did too. Hallelujah to God. How bright is your life? You must understand that the world sometimes will never pick up a Bible. You must understand that the world sometimes may never come through those doors. That's right. That's right. But the Bible has declared that we are living epistles. In other words, we are representation uh -huh. of what the standards of God should be. Yeah. Yeah. I don't hear nobody here yet. Yeah. Yeah. I want to do it to God. Jesus. Now, the days I told you to share with you before that when I received Christ, we didn't just come up and do a sinner's prayer mm -hmm. that the saints made sure you got a little something in you because you had to roll up the bitches a couple of times. Some of us purged what they used to call it. Come on, some of y'all remember those days. Hallelujah to God. And when we got up, the saints still told you you just got touched today. Yeah, that's a, that's a, that's a <laughs> I hear some of you saying amen because you remember those 
gold there. And ain't like it is now. It looks as if those folks are professing Jesus, but there has been no change or an example of a change. Jesus said, blessed are the poor in spirit. And the key thing is, you are the light of the world. But you know, people on your job, when you say you're a Christian, they're looking at how you walk and how you talk. They're looking at where your feet are treading and where your hands are going and how you talk to folk. In the school system, and you know sometimes I get to pray for myself. Lord, let my feet stay in line with your word. Sometimes you got folks that want to try to see if you really claim who you are. Come on now, somebody. And every now and then, what you talking about? Every now and then, I have to tell Craig, you have to come under subjection uh -huh. to the God that you say is your Lord. Yes, yes. There must be a difference yes. between us and the way the world can treat us. Right, right. I don't hear nobody. Yes. I thought about it like, I thought about when I was a little boy and uh, back in the 60s, yes. uh, down south is totally different now than yes. it was uh, from the 60s. You can almost go down there now and they got nice lights and, and and shining and bright as the star. Except when my dad was born, he was born in a place called Georgia, Alabama, about two hours from the Mississippi line and a couple hours from the Florida line. And, and I remember that day that you had to be in the house by dawn because the blackest night. You couldn't see your hands in front of your face. Some of y'all too young to remember and stuff like that. How you mean the God? And I was told that when a lot of them came north, that the lights at night, they thought the sun was shining. <laughs> what are you trying to say, your brother preacher? That in the midst of darkness, yes. we are the light to the world. Yes. When you're dark, you can't see where you're going. Uh -huh. yes. When you're dark, you can't see what's around you. Yes. But when the light has appeared, the Bible says that it dissipates the dark. Yes. How bright is your light? Some of us are kind of glad our lights are a little dim. Some of us are kind of glad that our light is out a little bit. Because uh, Shaniqua knows she better not say the wrong thing to me because she's about to get it. Fuquan knows he better not step my way because he's about to get it. But when you're the light of the world, his ways are not your ways. His thoughts are not your thoughts. There was some time when Shaniqua was getting ready to get it that the Holy Ghost had to step up in me. And Shaniqua would have been thankful. I'm here nobody here. Because you never know who's watching your life. Amen. We'll have a witness here. Amen. And if we're not an example to the world of what holiness is, then who is? In Buffalo, oh, yes. hatred on the uprise. I know. I know. I'm gonna tell you the truth. Lord, yeah. The crazy part of me was like, just put him on the street. Mm -hmm. Take all those weapons away and pin him on the street, please. Mm -hmm. Bring him to Newark. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But the Holy Ghost said, You gotta love him love it, when they don't know no better. Yeah. How many remember when you were in darkness? <laughs> How many remember when you were doing all that you were? I remember being in the church and being in darkness. Yes. But the love of the light. Yes. Thank you. Sometimes God's example is the light of other saints and yes. someone else. Yes, yes, Lord. And all you need is that one time to turn your light out. Thank where a soul has been watching you. My Lord, my Lord. I must not be saying anything here today. That you turn them away yes. into eternal yes. darkness. Yes. How many are glad that you saw the light? Yes. The yes. How many are glad that you saw the light? Yes. 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 We live in a day and time that we're compromising too much to satisfy mm. the world. Mm. I'm looking at how we're doing in the church. We're allowing our young people and, and ourselves to be example that it's all right to still fornicate. Lord, you come to church and you, that word will change it. It's all right 
hurting them in adultery. It's all right to lie because it's all, we're making it like it's all right. But I still believe there's a difference between clean and unclean. There's a difference between holy and unholy. Somebody say glory to God. Glory to God. I can't do nothing like I want to, but I want to relate the message. We have let our lights dim down. Yes, yes. Mm. yes, we do. Somebody say glory to, glory to God. That's why I'm so glad that the greater the sin, the greater the grace of yes. God. Because you know what? Even when I allowed my light to dim out, his mercy was sufficient for me. He covered me in the midst of my mess. But holiness is still right. Y'all won't hear me here. The way I used to be. When I come to the light, God changes me. The way I used to walk, I don't go to those places anymore. The way I used to talk, I can't even use those words anymore. Because the light of God's glory. How do you know the light will show you yourself? too busy trying to point out what somebody else is doing. But the more the light, the brighter the light. How does this light get bright? Hallelujah, God. The Bible says in Romans 12, submit yourselves unto God. Present your bodies a living sacrifice. Holy and acceptable unto God. Which is your reasonable service? Oh, this is the key. And be not conformed. In other words, you're shaped and you're in the image of. Be not conformed to this word. The light changes your image. The light changes your shape. The light changes your thinking. The light changes your speaking. How bright is your light? I remember a time we didn't look like the world. But now we live in dead time. You can't only tell the same. From the ceiling. I ain't talking about no pants and makeup either. If you know we couldn't do that back in the day. But we done got so loose, there must be a change even in your appearance. Yes, sir. Yes, I believe that. Amen. When you're walking in the light. I'm going to tell the prostitute to come to Jesus, and I'm on the corner looking at her. I'm on the corner. I'm on the corner. I'm on the corner looking like I'm pimp. Well, well, there must be a difference. Yeah, 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 I yeah, look. Yeah. The light changes your yeah. attitude. Yeah. The light changes your gratitude. Yeah. Yeah. How bright is your light? Yeah. I'm almost Thank done. You, How do I allow my light to become brighter? Mm -hmm. Now one thing I'm going to tell you. I'm not one person who likes to be in the dark. <laughs> Thank God I grew out some things you grew up with. You know, when you grew up, uh, they told you the hanks were in the dark. Uh, uh, most yeah, times, yeah. my younger brother, we had to sleep with the light on uh, when he was there because he was scared of dead folk. <laughs> and if I watched a vampire picture, I had to keep the light on because in the darkness, things creeped at night. Yeah. You ever notice the rollers don't come out till it get dark? <laughs> but when the light is on, mm -hmm. everything that's not right is shown up. I'm here yeah. right here. When the light comes, the light shows you where you need to step yeah. up at. When the light comes, it shows you where you need to change at. Yeah. When the light comes, how bright is your light? Mm -hmm. Well, this light gets brighter. Uh, I'm going to try to do this thing like my roots come from Alabama. When the light gets bright, glory to God. Somebody say, thank you, Jesus. It's because I've been on my knees in prayer. Sometimes I know I'm messed up and I know I'm disgusted, but praying on my knees causes the light to fill my spirit and become more like him. Somebody say, glory to God. How bright is your life? Saints, I come to tell you today that the world is not going to get any better. That these circumstances are not going to get any better. That things are even going to get worse. 
It looks like racism is on the rise. It looks like segregation is yeah. even starting even yeah. the more. Yeah. Well, actually, this is really nothing new, uh, but it has appeared itself uh, in this time and this season. Yeah. And it also looks like, my young man, uh, that the church is not the same anymore. Well, I'm sharing with him as I was coming. When I first came here, it was packed in here. Yeah. And I'm not just talking about it, but it's happening everywhere where yeah. folks have become comfortable yeah. with not having to have to come yeah. to the house of the Lord. Yeah. But that same Jesus, that same Jesus. I won't hear nobody yeah. say he must be uh, the light of the world. Yeah. Uh, and we got to tell dying men and women uh, yeah. that Jesus is yeah. on his yeah. way back. Uh, yeah. That there must be a difference. Just thinking things have changed so much uh -huh. because we do too much. 
somebody in the pew. Uh -huh. Just because folks in the pew don't mean that a change is happening. Yes, yes, yes. The light is the unadulterated truth uh -huh. yes. when you don't want to hear it. The light don't always, when the light comes on, it doesn't always make you happy to see what you see. And if I turn off the light to compromise, help me, Holy Ghost. If I turn off the light to compromise your feelings, then you'll never clean up the mess. I hope I'm saying something here. The light comes to change us. Pastor, my prayer life don't stop when I did. I gotta pray early more to get my mind straight. I, know, I, I gotta let that light come on early in the morning. Yes. And those kids in school will tell you in a minute, I thought you was a Christian. Oh, they always <laughs> I thought you was wrong too. <laughs> <laughs> I work alone. <laughs> let that light shine. That men can see Christ in you. Amen. They ain't gonna pick up the book. Sure you hold the book. Yes. 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 Don't cut your husband out because you got mad. Show righteousness. Amen. Don't cut your colleagues out because they got on your nerves. Show the light. Because the light is going to draw us. You know, the, the, the light, the lighthouse. Now, what they use when the ships were lost at sea. Yeah. Thank you, Holy Ghost. We have allowed our lights to go dim. Yeah. Yeah. We have allowed our lights to go out. Mm -hmm. And the world can't find a place of safety yeah. anymore. Yeah. 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 I, I, I'm not beating yeah. folks up on Zoom because I think Zoom adds its purpose. Because yes. yes. if you're an older person, you can't get out. If you are ill and can't get out, Amen. there should be no excuse when you got every limb in your body. It's an action. Yeah. Hello? Hello. How bright is your light? Yeah. Well, I don't have to go to church to serve God. Mm. Well, my mom says, fail yeah. not the assembly of yourself. Yeah. That's a part of the light. I make that sacrifice. Amen. And I know where you come from. We make that sacrifice every week. Amen. To get to the house of God. Yes, sir. Because sometimes that light needs a refueling. Amen. I don't know who this is for today. Some of our lights have gone out because you haven't come to get refueling. Because nowhere in the world you're getting refueling and you're on Zoom and the TV's on. And you're cooking your greens. Well, you should preach this more child trying to turn the green down a little bit. Uh -huh. yes. No way. Yes. The light's refueling comes with sacrifice. Yes, he he sacrificed for us. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. That ocean. He yes. said, I'll be lifted up. Uh -huh. oh, hallelujah. Yes. Oh, and listen, light. We can't always stay on the inside. Yes, we gotta take the light into the darkness. Yes, yes. Am I making sense? Yes, yes. yes. that's the truth. Thank you, Lord. I know oh, this. I'm gonna say this. I noticed that when the pandemic came, it looked like the Lord thrust us out of our buildings, right? Because mm -hmm. I was one of the ones. I'm tired of church like this. Mm -hmm. We all knew what church was. A, we say, B, we pray, C, we read the scripture, the same old thing. We dance a little bit, but we're still walking out lying, still walking out sick, still walking out depressed. When the light comes, he brings deliverance. When the light comes, the light that dwells in me speaks healing. Watch 
tell me I flicker the light. Yes, yes, yes. I can I, I, I can I can light up when I come to church because I get from your energy. Yeah, I'm all sure. I can light up a little bit because you're praying for me. I can light up a little bit because you encourage me. But how about strengthen? the voltage of our light. 
the world may see the good works and glorify the Father which is in heaven. God, we repent for allowing our light to dim. We repent, Lord, for allowing it to flicker. Recharge us. Rejuvenate others in the name of Jesus. That the world Charge your life. I want you to clap those hands and give them some praise. Open your mouth and give them some praise.